So shooters and reloaders, today we're gonna test these nice laser cast 255 grain semi wood cutters, but we're gonna test them for accuracy and velocity, but also mainly for leading at low velocity because these are hard bullets designed for high velocity and people that shoot them at low velocity get a lot of leading. So let's see if we get that. Forty-five skill and the velocity readings was 816, 819, 844, 793, 814, high of 844, low of 793, average 817, square 51, and deviation 18. So not as consistent a load, but uh, perhaps a tighter crimp will help that. That lower left target just shot the Schofield with the laser cast bullets and if it wasn't for the fifth round it would have been a one hole group that was tiny. So that's the group that was shot from the rest at 12 and a half yards with the laser cast bullets. A pretty accurate bullet. So I fired five and checked the six and that crimp is good. But we could give a little tighter crimp to get lower standard deviation. Target changes just in time because that gun's getting too hot to hold. And we put about 40 rounds into that lower right target. Did drop one though. And cleanly split playing cards is a lot of fun at the range of 12 and a half yards offhand shooting. Look at that barrel. There's not a lot of lead in there. Check the other side. Now that's what we're talking about. That should clean up nicely without too much trouble. Let's go ahead and do that. And the chambers can still stand a little bit more touching up, but pretty much clean. So look at that, there's still traces of lead in there, but not bad, and it didn't take that much to clear that out. So yeah, those hard cast, laser cast bullets do shoot uh, pretty clean at low velocity, at least in this gun. So uh, we do like that. Bye for now.